This is ChristianLivingRadio.com. You're listening to the Caribbean and Urban American Gospel Hit Show with Landlord and Mike D. Good day to you and welcome to Caribbean and Urban American Gospel Hit Show with yours truly, Landlord and Mike D. It's the great current gospel hits from the Bahamas, the Caribbean, and from all across America. Father, sometimes life seems to go not in the way that we plan, but we know for sure that you are always in our midst. Yeah, that was our first 
Caribbean song for the week. And that song is actually done by me, yours truly, Landlord. And man, that song right there was originally um, done by Sinaj. And man, it is a beautiful song. This song has really brought me through some rough times, man. It really encouraged me and I had to do this over, man. I put it in a reggae Caribbean form and man, I just love this song, man. I just released this um, a few days ago. It is on CD Baby. It's on all digital outlets like iTunes, Spotify. Go online and support your boy, all right? Man, it is a lovely song and I'm sure you guys were blessed. And now to my brother from another mother. Can you please introduce our guest all the way from the U.S.? We want to welcome the gifted songstress who can sing, sing, sing. (laughs) She's so well loved here in the U.S. and all around the world, I'm telling you. The lovely and anointed Beverly Crawford. Beverly, welcome, Pastor. How you doing? Thank you so much, my G. I'm so always good to be a part of, of these wonderful shows. Just being a part of this has just been a great blessing. Oh, likewise, dear. Always an honor to have you. Hi, Mrs. Crawford, and welcome back to the Caribbean and Urban American Gospel it Show. You know, I'm just loving this new song. You know, you have given so much to the gospel music industry over these years, you know, reaching millions of people, you know, but are you pleased how this young generation of gospel artists are handling and dealing with the gospel industry? Yes, landlord. You know, it it is really incredible. I think my job is uh, to encourage them, you know, even though you do your, your new music and you do a little different things, Always keep traditional gospel alive, and that's what I encourage them to do, and to have a balance, you know, balance it. You Mm -hmm. know, you have your contemporary, you're doing your worship, you're doing your hip-hop, you're doing the little rap, but add some hymn in there, too. Go back to some of the old songs, and so that's what I've been encouraging young people to do. And then, surprisingly, they have been loving traditional music, too, and so it has truly been a blessing, so it hasn't been a hard job. And, uh, to encourage them. And I, I think that as we are the ones who have been out here a long time, if we keep encouraging them and keep uh, building them up, it'll all just come together. And I think that's what it's doing. Mm-hmm. Amen. You know, Pastor Beverly, I agree with you 110%. It is people like you that have paved the way for many of us in the music industry. And we are so grateful and thankful for all the work that you have contributed. Beverly, you know, I sometimes think about way, way back when you were on uh, the Bobby Jones Gospel uh, yeah. TV on B- BET for several yeah, years baby. singing in the choir of Bobby Jones and New Life. Yeah, that was before you yeah. went solo. And you got started with Bobby Jones Gospel on BET in an amazing uh-huh. way. You know, you, after your husband, Todd, did a video recording of you and your sister's the gospel group, uh, the Camp Sisters. That's right. That's and Bobby right. Jones saw that video and he was like, yeah, uh-huh. y'all come on on, come on on the Bobby Jones gospel. <laughs> of course, loved your singing and, and had you uh, yeah. on, in his choir uh, for several years that's, on the on TV. Right. People were watching you, millions of people. And, you know, yeah. that was before all of this social media and, and YouTube stuff. But I tell you, that's right. uh, Pastor Todd, your husband, he took that home video of you guys and was sending it out. And Bobby Jones saw it. Uh-huh. Uh, that's right. Pastor, Pastor Todd was the YouTube back in back in. Yeah, the day. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he surely was. He surely was. <laughs> That's an amazing way. It just goes to show yeah. you that when you just follow in the steps ordered by God, His plans yeah. for us will, will come about. Walk by faith, not by sight. Right. That's right. That's right. Got to do it. And that's what happened. Uh, I I told this earlier, imagining that the grass was my audience and the stick was my microphone out in the country as a little girl. (laughs) And now to see God bring that to pass. Now the grass is the audience. And now the microphone is that stick is a real microphone now Mm. that I go all over the world and minister to. So, you know, don't give up on your dreams. Don't give up on your vision. Don't look at your situation. 
situations, but look beyond it because God got it. You have to understand that that He is your shepherd. Psalms twenty three. He's your shepherd. You shall not want. He will He will make you lie down in green pastures. He'll lead you beside the still waters. He'll restore your soul. He will lead you in the path of righteousness for His name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valleys of the shadows of death, I will feel no evil because God is with me. He got my back. He gonna take care of you. You gotta trust Him. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, have faith in God, yeah. that's for sure. Hallelujah. For real, you know, that's all we can do. We just got to trust him and believe in him. Mrs. Crawford, there's a fan of yours uh, from actually Trinidad, Mr. Zahir Mohammed, and he wants to know, when you look back at your life, what one thing that you can truly say you are very proud of? I'm so proud of how many people have been touched and saved, healed, and delivered through the gift that God has given me and uh, that God has put me on this platform for a reason, and I use it for all his glory. And I think that's the, the most precious thing that he would use a vessel like me, you know, to, to spread his message. Thanks so much, Zahir Muhammad. You know, um, Pastor Crawford, um, that was a awesome and amazing answer to that question because you know what else <laughs> what else would you want you know um thank you so much and i'm sure he was listening god bless beverly give our best to pastor todd and your daughter and son and everybody congrats oh i'm telling you that song mine is on the way it's hot 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 and we'll be checking out your upcoming album when you you know that's going to come out next year i know you're going to record that live in Jacksonville later this year. We'll be yes. checking that out, waiting for that, and I, I know it's going to be super duper. God bless you in each and every way, and thanks for hanging out with us. Sister Beverly Crawford. Yeah, um, Pastor Crawford, um, thank you so much for joining us today on the Caribbean and Urban American Gospel Lit Show, and wish you all the best. Thank you so much, Landlord and Mike D., and all of you in the Caribbean Islands and the Bahamas, we love you all and bless God for you. I don't know about you, but I just feel a breakthrough coming. <laughs> oh, I know it's on the way. Do you feel it? Oh, come on, let's have some church. <laughs> Instead of harvest, I'm getting weak. It seems like everyone is being blessed. But I'm the only one that's being stressed. So I got down on my knees. I heard a voice speaking to me. It said, your labor is not in vain. I'm getting ready to send the rain. And I heard a sound. <laughs>
That song is by the gospel songstress Beverly Crawford. The multi-stellar award recipient Beverly Crawford is so well loved. And the song is Mine is on the Way. <laughs> Amen. Have faith in God. That song, Mine is on the Way, is the brand new song from the gospel songstress Beverly Crawford. And Pastor Beverly and her husband, Pastor Todd Crawford, co-pastor a church in Gainesville, Florida, too. And we want to thank the gifted Beverly Crawford for joining us today on Caribbean and Urban American Gospel Hits. Landlord Beverly Crawford loves the Lord, and she's so dedicated to Him. Well, you know, Mike, uh, when you talk about a dedicated woman, you know, uh, Pastor Beverly Crawford name just pop up because she has dedicated her life to the ministry. Mm -hmm. And, you know, to many people out there who uh, battle with cancer, cancer was one of the things that really draw her close to her fate and to her God. And man, from since cancer met her, I know the enemy was mad because trust me she just uh rage war against the enemy in cancer and she just continue to wage war on satan kingdom man pastor beverly crawford she is awesome and an amazing artist right now we're going to jamaica from our next awesome artist goes by the name of ryan mark he have a new single called love you guys gonna love it
that's why I sing whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, 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 love, oh, love. That's the wonderful, smooth sound of Ryan Mark. He's been a pastor for a few years now, too, in Jamaica. And then, Lord, he's always pleased to give someone a good word from the Lord. Well, you know, Mike, um, that is a beautiful song for real. And, you know, um, Ryan Mark is no stranger to us here in the Caribbean and the Bahamas. He's a big artist. He's been contributing beautiful music for over the years. And he always know how to just bring that beautiful music and cause you to really worship, man. Enough respect to Ryan Mark. You know, right now at this time, if you are a gospel artist and you want to be featured on the Caribbean, being an urban American gospel it show, please send us your music at landlord for rent at hotmail.com. That's the digit four, not F O R or F O U R. All right, well, you know, Mike, we are at the end of the show once again. If there's something you would like to leave with our listeners, oh, God is mighty and God is able, trust and love God for sure. All right, Mike, thank you so much. And at this time, I just want to thank Pastor Beverly Crawford for joining us today. And I just want to thank you guys who listen to us every week. You guys could have been doing something else, but you choose to listen to us. And we truly appreciate you. And we look forward to you joining us next time on the number one radio station here. This is yours truly, Landlord. And on the behalf of Mike D and everyone here, thanks for being with us on the Caribbean and Urban American Gospel It Show. But before we go and close out, I'm going to leave you with one more song. It's a new release. It's also a cover song done by William McDowell. I give myself away. I redid it. And trust me, you guys are going to love it. It, it. it is awesome. A nice, beautiful Caribbean song. So until next time. God bless you, and may the Lord continue to shine His light on you. I give myself away, Father. It's only I you. I give myself away. I give myself so to you. Can you me? Take me, Father. I give myself away.
Living Radio, spreading the good news of Jesus Christ 24-7. Our goal is to bring you a life-changing word through music and diverse programming like the one you're listening to now. Pastor Kenyatta Goins is the visionary of Christian Living Radio, and he's dedicated to the idea that Christians should even have a more prominent presence in the marketplaces. Maybe you need prayer for yourself and or your family, maybe for a friend. We'd be privileged to stand in the gap for you. If you're listening to this broadcast, click on the Contact Us tab and send us your prayer request. We'd also like to hear from you if you have something on your mind or just give us some feedback. We support many ministries, so maybe you'd like to make a one-time or a monthly recurring donation. We believe that when you sow into these ministries, you'll indeed be blessed. And of course, if you sow into this show in particular, we believe that it's a blessing for you, so please consider sponsoring us. There's a special area under the Donate tab where you can send your monetary gift or call 520-812-6363. That's 520-812-6363 to receive more information about sponsorship. Thank you. Christian Living Radio. 